here with women's basketball coach Mandy Pearson. Coach, a huge win on Saturday against Augsburg in a game that really you needed not only for just to get the win, but you, you locked up a, a conference playoff berth. Talk a little bit about, about doing that, something that hasn't been done in a number of years here, 2004, 2005, was the last time that St. Mary's has been in the MIC playoffs. You guys are heading back there this year. It's exciting. You know, it's, it's great for our team because they've worked really hard. You know, not even this year, just in years past, um, they have really done a great job of changing some things in, in, the, in the program here and have worked hard to you know, get to this point, so it's pretty exciting. But uh, it really comes down to a bunch of close games this season. So it's it's fun to see us make the tournament, um, but even more even more fun to think about how we did that this year with all the close games that we had. I mean, we had a, a million one point games, or you know, St. Ben's, Carleton, both times that we beat them, it came down to last second shot so it's fun to see us win those games to put us in a good position at the end of the year. Have you experienced a half like you had uh, Saturday against Augsburg? You go into the locker room you've got 34 points they've got nine. Yeah. I mean from from a fan standpoint it was just amazing to, to see how well you played defensively and to go into the locker room with such a big lead. Uh, experienced a half like that? Not, not for a while. <laughs> um, but we, they executed really well. You know, we knew what they were going to do on offense. We knew that, what they were going to do defensively. It's just there are no secrets anymore in the MIAC because of all the, the game tape stuff that we have. But it was just our execution and our confidence that, I mean, really put us in that position. We were great defensively. Um, our communication was awesome. And offensively, we really took advantage of what, what their defense gives us. And they did a great job of having that poise to – you know, make the plays that we needed to and knock down some shots. Now we talked about you making it into the playoffs, but with two games left in the season, there's still a lot to play for. You you still are battling for a, a chance of playing a, a home playoff game. Mm -hmm. Talk a little bit about the game against Hamlin on, on Wednesday and, and the importance of that game. It's a big game. You know, I mean, it is. If, if, if we would like to try and get home court advantage for the first playoff game, um, it'll be a big game for us because, you know, their record's not as good as ours, but... They're a talented team and they're scrappy, uh, and they've been in a lot of games. Even though you know their roster size isn't huge right now, so it's going to be it should be a fun game for us. And hopefully, we come out with a lot of poise, a lot of confidence, and a sense of urgency to you know try and get that home court advantage. Seven thirty Wednesday evening at uh, Hamlin. Good luck, coach. Thank you.